Hello friends, welcome to Java Tricky program series. So let's see what we have for today. So here I have this base class where I have this public string name variable. And then I am having this derived class which is extending base. And if you notice that here also I have this name variable, but it is private. So it should not be accessible from other classes. Now this is my main method. And here I am saying to create an object of derived class and then dot name. So what should happen here? So we know that when uh, any class extends another class, it inherits its property. So since base properties are being inherited by derived and uh, derived has this private, so will it use this name name variable from base class here or it will throw some error or something else let's see this in a eclipse program okay so here i have copied the same program and as you can see that it's actually giving a compile time error and if you see the error is clearly showing that the name is not visible so here even if the base class has this name property that is public it is getting hidden here why because when uh, we are trying to create this derived object it's going here and it's using this name variable and since it is private the compiler is throwing error so this is one way to hide the variable of a super class because if I just change this to name one you can see that the error is gone and if we will run this it will print base so this is how we can uh, hide the property or method of uh, super class in a subclass however we should avoid doing this because we never know uh, what will be the consequences for example let's say that we have this class and uh, this is some other class where some code is like that and now we just added this variable having same name in base class so we don't know that it will cause issues in the client program where that is being used. So we should try to avoid it but I have included here so that uh, you get to know about this and uh, if you see any online quizzes then uh, you know what will be the output in this case. So thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.